Well, welcome to the presentation of an AccuBoost product. AccuBoost RI is embedded software enhancement for Sage 100 Cloud ERP platform. Today, we're going to go over the field data capture delivery system enhancement. So with this enhancement, uh, we uh, provide access to uh, tasks and dispatch information uh, entered in Sage 100 on mobile devices. Uh, you can uh, edit the dispatch's status and date, add additional items, labor code, capture signature, uh, upload it attachments in the field, taking pictures, uh, uploading them to the task so they're available in Sage 100 as well as processing deposits or, or printing the dispatch information on a printer uh, after you capture the customer's signature. So um, app is downloaded from uh, Apple Store or Google Play. It's called Sage 100 Field Service. Once downloaded, it's displayed on, 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 the, on the phone. And this is how the app is uh, displayed. Uh, so we, we, uh, each uh, task is, is service worker is displayed as a cell. Once you click on it, it opens up the task. The system has the ability to work online or offline. You can see, so if you have technicians that go to places where there's no access uh, to cell signals, so you can still process information. Uh, these patches are shown on the screen. So here we're looking at a, an, an, a notebook PC screen. Uh, so again, each one of these cells is a dispatch. You click on it, you show it, see the information. You can search for uh, by any field in the uh, in, in the task. As you click on different icons, like the customer or the task information, information is displayed. Now things are whether or not you're showing AR balance or credit limit, these are settings, security settings, so you can decide whether or not you're showing that information. Uh, so uh, the dispatch header information, it contains some information about the total for that specific dispatch. Uh, you can uh, look at the items information, the item tab. You can add additional items, deleting items. We support voice recognition, so you could actually um, speak the comments that you want to add or add it when you're adding a description. You can just speak to the phone or the PC, and it will capture that. Uh, and store it in the cell. Similarly, in the labor field, you have the ability to uh, add additional labor codes or speak to uh, the notes and store those in the system. Here's how you can capture signature for the task and the capture signature uh, could be printed uh, if you have a belt printer and, and given to the customer. Of course, the uh, printed uh, invoice is also stored uh, as part of the task so it could be viewed. As part of this enhancement, we also uh, do uh, optimize route display. So if you, the technician is going to be four or five places, you can uh, select the task that you want them to go to and the system uh, integrated with Google Map. It will come back and tell you how to send the person, what direction. It will also show you where technicians are, a specific technician or uh, your different technicians based on the locations, the last locations that they perform any time. So I'm going to start the actual demonstration on, on, on a PC. Later on, I will uh, log into my phone and I will uh, show a transaction process uh, on, on my, uh, my phone, which is a, a, a Samsung uh, S9 Plus. So here the system is showing the, the tasks and dispatches that are assigned to the technician, Alec. Now, if I come to Sage 100, I will see that. Uh, on a scheduling board. These are the tasks that are scheduled, assigned to Alec. You have the ability to set up uh, what tasks uh, types are displayed on handheld as well, as well as how many date ranges. Of course, this is our scheduling board. You can drag and drop something from one day to the other uh, if you do not want the technician to see that on the scheduling board. Coming back to our PC, so if I click on the on the customer icon, I will see some customer information about the customer, AR limit, uh, AR credit limit, AR balance, and or, and so forth. Simply, if I click on the task, I will see some information about the task, about who the customer is, and so forth. If I double click on the line, uh, basically, system would take me to the task that I just clicked on, and I'll be able to see uh, the information about that task. So um, here, uh, uh, would be the task 944. I have the, da the task header information. I could do things like if I want to mark it as completed, I could do that. If I want to come to the items, look at the items, modify quantity of an item from two to three, 
and and so for two and a half three i could do that easily i uh, go to the labor tab may, may, maybe on the labor tab add a new labor code and uh, training i want to add that as now notice that i have this microphone which is basically i can easily add uh, the text by speaking into this uh, pc uh, by just clicking on this icon i completed the training of four technicians today so basically that gets added and of course that's very easily added to the uh, task in stage 100 uh, which we'll look at it and, and, and later and we'll be able to print it on the invoice signature capture will give me let me give you the ability to capture a signature i could save that signature that i just captured uh, very easily if i have any uh, documents on my uh, phone or on my pc that i want to also add maybe i've taken a picture i could do that and basically that would be available also uh, i could easily print this information so uh, i could print this information including the capture signature and so forth if i had a belt printer with me and and hand it to the customer uh, so it's it's very easy uh, to capture information in the field all of the information captured is updated to the Sage 100. Now, of course, we support online and offline mode. So if I come here to the Sage 100 system that I had and I go to, to my tasks and bring up that task 944, we will be able to see those documents that we just uh, basically added to the system. So I would have the signature uh, here captured and displayed now i'm showing it on on, a, on the paint i could have the uh, the printed invoice with the signature attached to it displayed and of course i could also have that document that the sage uh, partner uh, document that i uploaded so information is very easily uh, uploaded from handheld devices to the dispatches uh, similarly if i uh, come to the dispatch i would be able to to see the labor code and and that uh, text that we've added for it for the training and and i'll be able to see that uh, comment that i spoke to it i completed the training of the technicians so coming going back i have the ability to perform all the functions that i want as a technician would want to do on the handheld device uh, and also have the ability to see uh, easily uh, basically uh, uh, for the customer that I've selected, for the customer that is part of this uh, task that I selected, I could see the, the next four scheduled tasks, the previous scheduled task. Now, this system is used as part of routing and you can uh, define routes in the system, schedule the, uh, the routes, uh, and the system would let you define what products should be taken out on Tuesdays, what product needs to take out on Thursdays. Tasks would be there easily. Uh, uh, the technician or the, the salesperson can bring up and, and make the changes to the items that they delivered and, and basically uh, market as such. So now I'm quickly gonna go through and, and show the information, uh, how, how information is kept, uh, this uh, worked up displayed on my cell phone, which is a Samsung uh, phone. So for that, I'm, you need to use a program that would, all it does, it just displays what's uh, what's on my phone uh, on a PC, so I can demonstrate it to us uh, as part of this. So here we're looking at now my, my, my cell phone. Again, it's a Samsung a Galaxy S9 Plus. I click on it, and this is an app that I just downloaded from uh, Google Play and it just works very similar to uh, the phone as far as uh, recognizing the voice as far as being able to see a customer's information as far as being able to see the task information capturing a signature uh, printing the uh, you know a task that you're, you're working on so all of that information is very easily uh, again uh, available and we talked about being able to do online or offline processing of transactions so um, i want to thank you for giving me the opportunity to to show you your enhancement i mentioned you'll be able to print it you'll be able to capture signature add pictures to the system thank you for uh, the opportunity to, uh, to to present our product please 
feel free to reach out to us if you need to see a more in-depth demonstration of our enhancement. Thank you.